Say again, we're going to hang on to some cooler temperatures uh, until we get into about into the coastline and areas. We do have some of that cloud coverage at we're in the lower 60s, but all in all, it is pretty cool. It's about 50 over in Covina, 54 in Pasadena. For, uh, quite a bit of heat, triple digits coming back for some of those inland spots. So the highs moved a bit more. It's just uh, moving around to the east of us, and then we still have this trough Head into tomorrow because that high pressure is going to build in a bit. But then the trough comes right back along the coast as we head into this weekend, and that's going to help cool us hey, back stud. off. So sure into Saturday like, is going to be subscribe. pretty nice. Sunday we might begin to see below. some slight warming because as we head into next week, into Monday, and especially Tuesday, Wednesday, we are going to see temperatures really rise quite a bit. Now, the other thing we might see is a little bit of precipitation. There's a very tiny we'll chance. Uh, what will then be weakened from Hurricane John that is off the coast of Mexico. And so as we head into next week, we do get right back up to about 80 degrees. So warm temperatures are turning. And, and then next week, we'll have triple digit heat there as well. All right. The sun peeking through, but you can still see it is partly cloudy for some spots instead of completely cloudy for some areas like yesterday. But it's cool outside. It's 56 degrees in Irvine. We have a lot of 50s out there and from downtown L.A. as well. It's about 57 degrees. We even have some lower 50s for the foothills and some far interior spots. So cool start and warm afternoon. Jaysha, I'll send it back to you. Coming up on Good Morning America with 90 days until Christmas, the holiday shopping forecast with where and when to find the best prices. Remember, we're always streaming around the clock. Just search that weather forecast with Brianna. Hey, good morning. We're in for some heat as we get into next week, so we're going to enjoy the next several days. It's going to be pretty nice. Our temperatures will go up and down a little bit, so I'll show you that in a moment. But if you're in the Los Angeles area, we have a little more sunshine this morning compared to yesterday, but our temperatures are cooler. It's going to stay cool all the way until that getting closer to 10 a.m and midday where we're still going to be in the low 60s until then and then by lunchtime we're going to get up to just about 72 degrees and then we'll just get up to about 79 today for downtown LA so if you're in that area some spots might be a little cooler than yesterday in Little Orange County getting up to 79 degrees and in the valleys and Inland Empire will be again in the upper 80s to low 90s depending where you're at so not too many changes uh, on the interior areas the beach is also a little cooler today 70 the mountains a little warmer at 78 and high desert, kind of the same where we were yesterday. So it really depends where you are with all of these microclimates. Again, all of the changes are not going to be major, but next week we may see some either heat advisories or watches be issued because we are expecting some triple digit heat to come back. More on that in just a little bit, Mark. I'll send it back to you for now. Okay, Brianna, thank you. Hey, good morning. Yeah, it's going to be a nice weekend too. But next week's going to be hot, so we're going to enjoy these next few days. We do still have some fog out there, marine layer clouds. We're not getting rid of that anytime soon as we look live from LAX. And next week we might, uh, especially with that heat that's going to be on the way, 61 degrees at LAX and well entrenched along the Malibu coastline where you can see that thick cloud deck that is in place right there, 59 degrees. Temperatures have actually been a bit cooler this morning, too. We have a lot of 50s outside, 59 in Ontario. We have some 50s in the high desert, and then just 50 degrees for Ojai, 52 Covina, 54 in Pasadena, and 57 Woodland Hills and Burbank. 
And then you get closer to the beaches, and we mostly have some low 60s except for Malibu and then maybe areas north of that. High pressure to the east of us. We have a little trough that's north of us, and so we're just waiting for that high to build on in, and it's going to as we head into your Friday. A little more so, so we'll warm up a couple degrees for certain spots tomorrow. And you can see by Saturday, it doesn't change too much. So we're going to stay with these more mild, cooler temperatures for a couple days here without any major changes. Then we head into, as we head into next week, that ridge is really going to build in. And what's also going to happen is the potential. It's not in the forecast yet, but sometime between Tuesday and Wednesday, we could see the possibility and add into the forecast uh, the chance of some precipitation and maybe even a thunderstorm. And that's going to be from what is Hurricane John off the coast of Mexico, which will be weakened at that point, but it will be traveling upwards. And so we might see a little instability because of that. So we'll keep you posted. Not in the forecast. Uh, areas get close to 90 degrees again. The valleys and inland empire triple digits in the forecast as we head in next week. So enjoy the next several where we're going to stay just in some upper 80s to low 90s into the weekend. Sunday will start to get a bit warmer, but Monday, through Wednesday, it is going to be hot. And so we will see temperatures approach about 100 degrees and some lower end triple digits too. We might even see some heat advisories be issued for some spots. The beach is very mild into the weekend. Not too much of a beach weekend. We're going to have probably quite a bit of cloud coverage, too, especially on Saturday. Then we head into Sunday. We'll continue on. Next week, uh, we will have nicer temperatures, warmer at the coast with some mid-70s in the forecast. The mountains, upper Sahai Desert, very warm, but next week it gets hot again. We're going to get back up to about 100 degrees. We'll go get close to it tomorrow and then fall back down to about 96 over the weekend. Palm Springs, going to be very hot this weekend. It's about 112 degrees, so it is just staying very hot for the low desert. We're not seeing much improvement or changes there in terms of temperatures and the heat that we've been dealing with in the Palm Springs area. All right, Mark, I'll send it back to you. Yeah, it's been warm, right?